For mixing the three solutions used in installing PPF Pro Series 200, you will need clean and clear distilled water, 70% IPA or 99% IPA. For this demonstration, we will use 99% IPA, baby shampoo or mild dish detergent, a measuring syringe, a funnel, three 32 ounce spray bottles differentiated either by markings or by design so you can easily visually tell them apart during the installation. Take the top off a 32 ounce spray bottle and insert your funnel into the bottle's opening. Pour 32 ounces of clean and clear distilled water into your spray bottle. Remove the funnel from the opening of your spray bottle. Remove the full cap from the top of the baby shampoo or mild dish detergent bottle. Installers must use a syringe to measure the baby shampoo or mild dish detergent as precision is important. The Pro Series 200 PPF uses less shampoo or mild dish detergent than Pro Series, resulting in a change in the slip solution composition. Measure 1.5 to 2 milliliters of baby shampoo or mild dish detergent into your syringe. Do not exceed 2 milliliters of shampoo or detergent. Squeeze the shampoo or detergent out from your syringe and into the 32 ounce spray bottle. Replace the caps on the baby shampoo or mild dish detergent bottle and your 32 ounce spray bottle. Gently tilt your spray bottle back and forth a few times to agitate the solution together. Do not shake the bottle as the resulting foam interferes with the PPF installation. This tack solution consists of two ingredients, clean and clear distilled water and either 70% IPA or 99% IPA. In this video, we use 99% IPA. Take the top off your 32 ounce spray bottle and insert your funnel into the bottle's opening. Bottles with volume markings on the sides are strongly preferred so that installers can mix solutions more easily using the markings as a visual aid. Pour 5 ounces of 99% IPA into your 32 ounce spray bottle. Note, installers using less concentrated IPA than that used in this video must adjust their mixtures according to the strength of the IPA they are using. Refer to 3M PPF installation guidelines. Pour 27 ounces of clean and clear distilled water into your 32 ounce spray bottle. Put the top of the 32 ounce spray bottle back in place. Gently tilt your spray bottle back and forth a few times to agitate the solution together. For the hybrid solution, installers must combine all three ingredients used in the tack and slip solutions into one bottle. This includes either 70% IPA or 99% IPA. In this video, we will use 99% IPA. Take the top off a 32 ounce spray bottle and insert your funnel into the bottle's opening. Bottles with volume markings on the side are strongly preferred so that installers can mix solutions more easily using the markings as a visual aid. Pour 5 ounces of 99% IPA into your 32 ounce spray bottle. It is important installers add the IPA to the bottle first so they can make use of the volume markings on their bottle more easily. Note. Installers using less concentrated IPA than that used in this video must adjust their mixtures according to the strength of the IPA they are using. Refer to 3M PPF installation guidelines. Pour 27 ounces of clean and clear distilled water into your 32 ounce spray bottle. Remove the full cap from the top of the baby shampoo or mild dish detergent bottle. Installers must use a syringe to measure the baby shampoo or mild dish detergent as precision is important. Measure 2 milliliters of baby shampoo or mild dish detergent into your syringe. Squeeze the shampoo or detergent out from your syringe and into the 32 ounce spray bottle. Put the top of your 32 ounce spray bottle back in place. Gently tilt your spray bottle back and forth a few times to agitate the solution together. Do not shake the bottle as the resulting foam interferes with PPF installation.